Okay, so hello YouTube, my name is lightfarmer.com and this will be yet another. I really don't need to change this one, but it will be um, a short video, I suppose. I'll be showing you how to remove this gunk from uh, from the chip. Now, actually, uh, I destroyed quite a few motherboards until I figured out the real temp, uh, the best temperature, at least in my opinion, and the best way to remove it. But it actually it is quite easy. Now, bear in mind that if you have, a, I have an infrared soldering uh, station, and uh, it is a bit harder to remove it. But I do have a remove it with this. But I do have this uh, blower, which I have set to around uh, 300 degrees, and uh, as you can, I'm sorry, as you can see, um, it is around 300, I think, 300 and something. Okay, that's about it. Now I did modify this tool, which is a dentist's tool. And as you can see, it is very thin and it can easily go underneath a chip, such as this. Now, let me show you the idea. Now, this is at uh, 334 degrees, which is, I would say, quite warm. Now, what I'm going to do is just go like here and push it out. And as you can see, this is going easily sorry again this is the tool and uh, you just push it underneath now you have to push it underneath because some of the gunk goes underneath the chip and if you do not remove it all you'll be saying curse words trust me in that one when you and you try to remove the chip okay okay you see it is actually quite easy and there is no effort actually at all so, this is basically it. Okay, and as you can see, there is a lot of gunk underneath that chip which needs to be removed. Because if you do not remove it, um, you will not be able to uh, lift the chip so that's pretty much it well I do hope you like this quick video if you have any questions don't hesitate to ask and that's about it bye bye